All right, oh, that shouldn't be there. So today I'm going to be unboxing these Next Tech earbuddies that I bought to replace my Apple earbuds that broke on me. That was a relatively easy unboxing. Um, so this is basically what they are. This is gonna be the fastest video I've ever done my entire life. I'll probably do some testing, but this is what they look like. They feel really cheap. They were really cheap. And uh, let's see how long the cord is. Hopefully I don't break these like I broke my last one. So this cord is, oh, maybe a little bit shorter than my arm span. Um, this is basically what they, I like these kinds of earbuds because they, A, don't stick in your ear. They don't go, like, straight into your ear, and those actually are painful. And number two, they actually feel nice. Well, my, my Apple ones did. I'm not so sure about these. Because these are kind of more plasticky. I mean, it's faux chrome. I mean, look at that. Isn't that just cheap? All right, so let's figure out some of the specs of these ear buddies. Like, about a week later. Still haven't uploaded this video. They're lightweight. I mean, come on. You can't get any lighter than pieces of plastic. But they're outer ear design. The drivers are 15 millimeters across. The impedance is 32 ohms. Sensitivity, I'm not even going to bother reading that because it's some weird number that I don't feel like going ahead to. Frequency response, 20 hertz to 20,000 hertz. It can take up to 10 milliwatts. Cable length, oh look at that. It's not even in meters, idiots. Plug type, stereo 3.5 millimeter. And of course, same thing in French. And of course, imported by the source. That's pretty much how that works.